Turning our attention now to the ASX, here's Matt Burney and Bulls and Bears with the latest public company views and interviews. Welcome to Bulls and Bears, brought to you today by Toronto-listed mineral explorer Novo Resources, TSX code NVO. I'm Matt Burney and I'm joined now by the Executive Chairman of Novo Resources, Mike Spreadborough. Hi, Mike. Hi, Matt. Okay, so Novo holds around 11,000 square kilometres of prime ground in WA's rich Pilbara region, where the company is testing for a suite of minerals, including nickel, lithium and gold. It recently identified multiple gold targets across its Edgina project after completing more than half of its 30,000 metre air core drilling campaign. Results have highlighted the district as a priority for an upcoming RC drilling campaign that will seek to further develop a series of long shallow gold drill hits. Okay Mike, tell me what are the key targets at Edgina and why? Yeah, we like uh, the Edgina district. It's just south of the Grays Hemi project, big 10 million ounce project. So we see the same geology, the same shear structures come into the northern part of Edgina, so we're busy drilling our Besher prospect at the moment, which is a very large zone, eight kilometre long zone, that we've started this air core program. All right, well, let's talk about that air core program. What are the best drill hits to date from that current campaign? Yeah, so we've started in September. We've just started to see the first lot of results. So we've seen 20 metres at 0.67, 12 metres at 0.24, really close to the surface, and then we've seen other good results like eight metres at 0.22, just below the surface. So this air core program is looking for a large mineral blankets just below the surface. These results give us a lot of opportunities now to follow up with RC drilling. So we're really excited with these results that we've seen. What kind of results have you been getting from your Nunnery North prospect? Yeah, so Nunnery is exciting. It's 80 kilometres south of Besher, so it's a pretty big zone for us to be looking for the gold. So our geos have been jumping out of helicopters doing uh, soil samples and rock chips. In soils, we've seen results like 2.3 grams per tonne, 2.13 grams per tonne. Uh, really, really exciting stuff there. We've also seen uh, you know, rock chips at 8.81 grams per tonne, 7.39 grams per tonne, but we've also seen rock chips up to 30 grams per tonne. Can you imagine that? An ounce of gold in a rock chip. Fantastic. Now, even though Novo is principally focused on gold, I know that, I know also you've got some nickel prospects in the pill, but what's the best one and why? Yeah, so we're focusing on a tenement we call Purdy's North. It's out near Carapa, just south of Azura's uh, very large nickel exploration program they're doing. So we've been drilling there for a couple months, people will start to see results uh, later this year or early next year but this is our primary nickel target that we're focused on. Just quickly, what was your cash at bank at last report and your debt position? Yeah, so we're very well funded Matt going into next year. We've got uh, $65 million Canadian in the bank we've got $20 million of investments as well but importantly we're debt free so we're well funded to move forward into 2023. Mike Spreadborough from Novo Resources, thanks for joining me on Bulls and Bears and remember we're only here to give you information, not advice which you should, of course, seek independently. I'm Matt Burney, and this is Bulls and Bears. For more public company CEO interviews, go to the money page at 6pr.com.au and click the Public Companies tab.